Hello friends, welcome back to Texan. Back with another video. This time it is a smart watch from the brand Nothing. I'm impressed by Nothing's founder, Cole Pai. He's a very uh, knowledgeable, clear and tech savvy guy who runs this new firm Nothing. He came from OnePlus ISU. I never had a Nothing product before, but I like the designs. So I ordered this one as soon as it came in Flipkart because it was provided with a very good budget price and I love the style of this watch. May look a little bit toyish but I love the style of this watch and when it came I'm pleasantly surprised by how it's packed. Stupendous pack cam which I've never seen something electronic at this pack like this. This is the pa a packing of nothing watch pro very thin and then we you have know, the watch and maybe the charger is here so let's go unbox this uh, this watch uh, the major advantage uh, is battery time like amazed with watches 14 days it guarantees and i'm 100 percent sure that is going to work because i've had amazed with, amazed with watches before and they give around 14 days battery the watch came out without the straps Nice, looking very premium, good build quality as you. And then let me open this. Okay, yeah, done now. I think this is a charger. Yeah, charger. USB A to a particular charger for this nothing watch. And this is what I love the orange straps. I love orange straps. Looks a little bit toyish, but uh, we don't really cool. The difference between a mace fit and uh, nothing. Watch bro, this is a mace fit, almost very similar. Back to the end, too similar. A mace fit watch looks fantastic. This is price, a mace fit pop to yes, price around 4999 uh, Now I got 4500 This steel strap washing looks nice on my hand too so this is the nothing watch i just want to do the unbox unboxing oh, yeah it's turning on cmt by nothing that's a different brand i think france italian english okay you need to scan okay you need to scan qr code to pair okay what I like about this Chinese watch is the battery time these watches give us. Basically, because if you look at Samsung watches, one and a half days, that's all you get. Scanning QR code. I'm trying to. Yeah, done. Open link. CMF watch for Android device came up. Installation is happening. So as soon as you scan CMF device for Android watch comes up. Some website pgyr.com app insulation. The insulation is happening. Let me give you a few more points. This is my Samsung Galaxy Watch 4. This is my Amazfit watch. This is my Amazfit Pop 3S. This is the Amazfit GTR 2. 12 day battery time. Amazfit Pop 3S. 14 days battery time. It gets charged very quickly. Around 30 minutes, it gets fully charged. For 4,000, you're getting a battery charge. Around 30 minutes, it's fully charged. This one takes a little more time. Good thing about this is you can use this watch to call, there is a dialer here. This one doesn't come with the dialer. You can only receive calls. Both stylish, lightweight in the Galaxy watch is really cool. Extra advantages like BP pressure monitor, BMI, and you know, a lot of health, like your cardio stuff and everything works with this one. But you know, these uh, two doesn't have it. But if you look at battery time, you charge the Samsung Galaxy watch fully and one and a half days, it's exhausted. You charge this and you use it for two weeks. We charge this and use it for 12 days. So for the price, you know, I got this for around, I think 
uh, below 5,000 in Flipkart. This was like 10,000 from uh, Amazon. Got it for an offer price. This is like 4,000 fine for the steel version. Now it's selling for 5,000. Still, if you look at battery life, you know, this is much, much better. The Chinese watches are much better. Samsung, if it gets the battery life to a little bit more, would be a lot of, uh, you know, good. The nothing one, why I'm fascinated is because of the design. And uh, yeah, it looks a little bit, you know, for the young people, but I like the design. The APK got downloaded and now it's going to get installed. I was wondering whether all the watches will get a USB-C charging technique, the charging cable. Would be much better. Otherwise, you know, some universal platform for some wireless charging would make a lot of sense. Like where you can just plant all these watches and charge for yourself. It's asking you to log in. I log in with Google. Authorization failed while logging with Google. One major issue I had with this Nothing Watch Pro was when I started this watch for the first time and scanned the QR code, I couldn't simply get the app to work. When I scanned the QR code, this would take me to a website. I think it's a Chinese website, but in, in, in English. And uh, they asked to download the APK, same up for nothing, watch APK. You download it and then you try to register yourself so that you can start using the watch. It doesn't work. I was trying to use uh, a register using my email, it was not working. Google login I was trying to use and it was always authorization denied or you know some server issue happening. And then you know I couldn't understand what was happening. I thought of doing something else. Went to the Indian Play Store, downloaded the CMF by Nothing app, and then it worked and this watch got registered. So if you're using this watch in India, do not download uh, the APK, which is actually going through the link from the uh, scan to a code from the watch. Just go to the Play Store, Indian Play Store, download the CMF by Nothing app, and then everything will work. With this Nothing Watch Pro, one of the main issues I'm having is this is a tad bit heavy on my wrist when I compare it with my Amazfit GTR2 or even the steel strap Amazfit Pop 3S. Slightly a little bit pressure on my wrist and I need to make sure that I wear it in a relaxed manner. Maybe if I try a different strap it might be a little more be relaxed but at the time uh, uh, this time what I find is it is slightly bit heavy on my wrist area and that is not something which I'm very comfortable with. So that's one of the woes I have uh, with this watch. The second thing with this watch is the battery life. It's advertised around 12 uh, to 14 days. Amazed with GTR2 gives me 12 days. Amazed with Pop 3 is 14 days and it's been very, very consistent. With this one, I did not use it much, but I just kept it on and I could see within the uh, fourth day of using this, uh, the battery life came down to around 50 from 100. So that's drastic and the battery drain and drop has been you know, very fast compared to the GTR2 or the Amazfit Pop 3S. And the charging time for this watch is slightly uh, higher compared to the GTR2 around 10 to 12 minutes higher and compared to the Amazfit Pop 3S around 20 to 22 minutes higher. So these are the negatives I found in this watch. Other than that, this watch is stylish. It's good to actually have uh, on your wrist as a style statement and almost every uh, exercise mode games is involved and it's a very trendy watch, very good for youngsters. So looking at the price uh, and Flipkart sale, it was selling around uh, 4,000. I got it for 4,500. So if you're getting uh, this one for a price of around 4,000, this is a very good buy. Another issue I uh, found in this watch was I wanted to change straps. So this is 22 mm straps. And when I got you know new straps from Amazon, what happened is this has got a very thin area where the straps are actually pushed in. 
So if you're buying new straps and the 22mm straps have a little bit more beefy edges on where the pin is, it won't fit in because the area where the strap goes in is very narrow. So if you're getting straps for this watch, get very thin straps on the pin area, otherwise it would not fit in. Other than that, this is a great watch and I'm very fond of the nothing design. I'm really liking this. Maybe in the coming uh, days, I understand how good this works, whether this will work better uh, for you know the accuracy regarding exercises and other data, sleep data, because Amazfit still is not as good as Samsung uh, in that. So I hope that this is slightly better than Amazfit. Friends, this is how it looks on my hand. The Nothing watch looks stylish for me. I'll just show you the different watches to show you how different it is. Let me try this Galaxy Watch 4. This is not the original Galaxy Watch strap. I got it from Amazon. This is how the Galaxy Watch looks. Okay. And now the Amazfit GDR2. Looks nice, this one too, looks nice. And for the classic or more of occasions, this MSP for 3S. The price is this one hell of a watch. Battery life, great options, everything available. Great watch. Only thing is, you know, while recording health data, Samsung is very accurate, the MSP lags back both these watches. Otherwise, you know, the price is a very good buy. These are the different options available in this watch. Exercise, exercise records, heart rate, blood oxygen, activity, sleep, stress, phone call, music, camera, remote, weather, breathing, voice assistant, stopwatch, timers, alarms, flashlight, find my phone settings. This is the dialer. You can easily dial any number using this dialer and call using Bluetooth over your phone aspect is the watch faces in this app is limited this is a relatively new app so in the long time it will be more and more you know options available but uh, now you know it's limited exercise options and games almost everything is included i will have to go through this watch a little bit more and try to understand how it works how the battery life works how the how accurate it is on measuring data regarding sleep data and exercise data. I'll have to just go through this for at least seven days to understand how it works. It is okay. It's a good watch. It should have been slightly more lighter and uh, very stylish though. I like the style. So yes, that's my whole feel about it. A little more better battery life, a little more better, uh, you know, like um, uh, charging time, uh, uh, less charging time for completely charging the watch. But overall, for the price, the build quality is supreme, premium, and very good to look at. And in Flipkart sale, if they're selling something around like 4,000 rupees, 4,000 rupees is a steal. You can go for it. Amazfit watches provide a little bit more value uh, than this at the moment because it's more experienced company has been producing watches for years. Nothing. Let's see how it turns out to be and how good it turns out to be. So that's about it, friends. Thank you for watching the video. Take care. Bye-bye.